Good morning from the Lime Garage here at Disney Springs. We are back today because Florida has opened today in phase two, which means that bars can open, it means that retail, and I think restaurants are now allowed to have more capacity. Retail for sure can be at 100%. So Eddie has the day off, I have the day off, we wanted to come down to Disney Springs, see what's different, see what's new, eat some food, have good times. Eddie's ready, ready, drink some beer, he says. I haven't, haven't had a beer since this whole any alcohol since this whole thing started. I know. Yeah. Take a look at Lime Garage. It is 12, one o'clock, 107. No one is in the Lime Garage. And when I say no one, there's a few people here, but <laughs> not very many. Lime Garage is where it's at. I've been parking in Orange Garage lately because every time I arrive, Lime Garage has been closed. But Lime Garage is the one I'm definitely used to. <laughs> Is a look at Polite Pig. This is definitely usually a really a popular spot. So seeing it this quiet is very rare. And we're heading on over to World of Disney. We already did our shopping there the other day, but uh, I don't know. It's always just a fun first stop here. Now there's definitely more people here today than there was last Saturday. Look at the Olaf lounge fly. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Eddie just pointed out the game of life, but Haunted Mansion style. And then right next to it, there's the Pirates of the Caribbean battleship. We could have used all of these puzzles in these games while we were stuck inside. Yeah. I've always known you can get a monorail, like a monorail tra train set, monorail set. But I've never seen the parking lot tram before. <laughs> That's really cool. Oh my gosh, they even have the cruise line and the Disney transport. Oh, that is so funny. Oh, and the bus that takes you from the, was that Magical Express from the airport section? There are still two full baskets of baby Yodas. Some people were asking me because I guess they sold out kind of quickly recently. But this is a huge basket. Look at him! What do you think of this baby Yoda? He's not as cute as ours. Yeah, ours is better. Ours is from Target. Yeah. I mean, he's cute and he's smaller so you can like take him places. exact thing. A tumbler that comes with a straw. These are 20. I don't know if I quite like it that much. They are cute, but I might hold off for the outlets. Looks like Once Upon a Toy is open. It wasn't open last week when we were here, so we're full of Disney toys. Uh -oh, looks like Trouble's here. That's not a good sign, Eddie. Oh man, I haven't seen Stormtroopers in so long. Oops. This is Station 2. No suspicious activity. We are gonna eat at Deluxe Burger for the first time. I am super excited. I've heard really good things about the burgers here. So we had mobile ordered our food. It said to have a seat outside until they tell us that our order is prepared. And then it looks like they have patio seating. Excited about eating some good food? We haven't had a sit down. Well, but I guess this isn't really like a restaurant. It's more like a counter service. Mm -hmm. But we still haven't really like sat down and eat somewhere. Yeah, we haven't. In like, what, four months? Yeah. You got the regular cheese burger, no onions. I got the same thing at a kid's meal. So cheeseburger, little side of fries, small drink. Okay. Good. Oh my gosh, it is juicy. Yeah. Wow. The bun is not as soft as I thought it would be. Really? But maybe that's a good thing since it's so juicy. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, it is dripping. <laughs> it also came with some carrots. Here. Let's see how small mine is. It looks like a slider. It does look, look pretty tiny. <laughs> it's really small. Oh, man, the meat seasons really well. I do wish it had some kind of special sauce or something. Like, it's missing a little bit of some kind of a sauce, even though we put ketchup and mayonnaise on mine. But it's really good. It doesn't taste fake. It tastes like a real nice piece of burger. <laughs> just enough meat, just enough seasoning. Yeah, that's so good. I would, I would totally eat here again. What did you think about your food, Eddie? It was pretty good. It was really yeah. good. Super you, juicy. Yeah. Yours was like crazy juicy. Yeah. <laughs> did you like the flavoring and the seasoning and everything? Yeah, I just wish it came with like some kind of a spread on it or something. That's what I said. It needs some kind of sauce. You're just putting like plain like ketchup and mustard. And yeah. I mean, it was seasoned really well, but yeah. it was still lacking that sauce. Yeah. Yeah. 
Did you eat here again? I eat here again, yeah. yeah. We're trying to get pictures for Instagram, so we're trying to find like little spaces where there's just no one around us. And then Eddie sets up his camera while I stand here really quick. And then as soon as his settings are good, I take off my mask and try to get a couple of shots. I mean, when there's absolutely nobody around you, I would think it's okay to take off your mask for a little bit. So that is how we're getting our Instagram pictures. restaurants and a lot more retail open today. We opted for a coffee instead of a beer for now. I didn't feel like it after all. <laughs> Needed some caffeine instead. Yeah. <laughs> I also got a Starbucks but I got the pineapple matcha drink. I usually get the matcha latte. That's one of my favorite drinks from Starbucks but I wanted to try the pineapple one. It's interesting. I mean it literally just tastes like a matcha green tea put in with pineapple but it's pretty refreshing. The ample cars are now launching. I also read that they are on a nice discount, though normally it's 150, I believe, to get on the ample car, but right now they're doing it for 75. Not too shabby. It's still a little bit pricey for me right now, but one of these days, I would love to do this. We're inside of the co-op. I saw this shirt the last time I showed you guys, but I saw this just now, and I think I'm gonna get it. It's got the Country Bears Jamboree and it's a tumbler with a straw. Only $20. I think I get 20% off with the annual pass. Good size, not humongous. Yeah, man, I think we found it. This is it. Ding, 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 ding. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. This is a wonderful suit. I haven't seen this in so long. Disney balloons. Oh, that is so exciting. Oh, it makes my heart a flitter. Just so you have an idea of the crowd, here is the quick look around. A decent amount of people, but nowhere near super busy. All right guys, thanks so much for joining me on today's quick adventure to Disney Springs. Eddie and I definitely had a really great time walking around, getting some yummy burgers. We definitely, definitely cannot wait to get in those parks. Universal opened today. We almost went almost i'm a little nervous i do want to see how the first day goes before i head in there just simply because it would be my first time going into universal period next week we got sea world we got bush gardens and then of course another month until disney opens but i can't wait things are slowly slowly progressing but we're getting there anyway guys thanks so much for watching stay positive love one another for sure, stop the hate and we'll see you later. Bye.